Are you sick and tired of gambling your hard-earned money on Madden and 2K packs? Well, look no further than my sponsor, MMO EXP, for the cheapest and the most reliable Madden coins and 2K MT on the market. A link for their website will be right at the top of the description. And do not forget to use code FURTY for 5% off. What's going on, guys? Today we have episode number 38 of the I Rate Your Team series. And easily, easily the most commonly asked question on all these videos is how do I get my team rated? Where do I send my team? Rate my team, it's godly. I get all these questions on all these videos, but I do answer the question in every single video. All you gotta do, you have two opportunities. The first way is by coming through to the Twitch live stream every single Friday night. Link for the Twitch channel down in the description. Just come through to the Twitch streams every Friday night. Link in the description. And the second way is just by sending me your team into the Discord server. Links for both the Twitch and the Discord are both down in the description. And all you got to do at about 5 p.m. Eastern, you're going to see right here today. Today at 5 p.m. Let's start. This guy's, this guy's got some tough reflection there. I see, you literally see him chilling in the... He's just chilling in the mirror, man. But um, yeah, at 5 p.m. Eastern is when I usually start. We're going to go to 5 p.m. today. Right here. 5 p.m. is when I start. So you send me your team and I just go through as many teams as possible from 5 p.m. on. So just send me a nice screenshot of your team. That's all you got to do. About 5 p.m. Eastern, we're going to get started here. Um, 15 minutes of offline teams. Then we're going to get into our live teams over on Twitch um, after this first after this first 15 minutes. All right, here we go. First team of the day is Dr. CBD's team. Definitely some kind of Titans team. All, I mean, not Titans, sorry. Jeez, Buccaneers team. Um, but also, it is nice if you send like a little description. Actually, yeah, he actually did it. You guys can see right here. He said Bucks 51 to 50, which is nice to see. But um, yeah, Chris Godwin. Okay, Godwin got a Sugar Rush card. He's actually pretty good. Le'Veon, is Le'Veon Bell really their best running back? There's no way that that's the Bucks' best running back. That Le'Veon Bell card is actually kind of a monster. Like he was one of the better Le'Veon Bell cards that we've seen in, in recent years. Like he's actually really good. Like he's he's like the free agent Le'Veon Bell in Madden 21. So on a theme team, I'm sure he's pretty good. But is he really their best running back? Damn, it's kind of tough. Oh, we got Josh Allen though. Gen three, good release. We have the budget Mike Allstott. We got the Sean Jackson. I feel like his offense looked. I feel like his defense looked pretty crazy. I mean, not that crazy. Winfield, I'm sure he's he has good stats on a theme team. I'm pretty sure of it. Logan Ryan's a good card for you know Giants, Titans, Buccaneers teams now. That his Redux is super cheap right now. I mean, I pulled him today. Um, he's going for about 100k. So I mean, Logan Ryan's a good purchase, a good card who is just normally too expensive, but now he's affordable. So I do like this card a lot. But uh, yeah, Pierre Desir, good size on a on a on a team like this. I'm sure he's nice. Even Richard Sherman definitely due for another upgrade this year. Probably a power of expansion for Sherman. I mean, hopefully it's not power of expansion. Or, I don't know. I guess we don't. I mean, whichever can happen sooner. I don't really care. But Sherman's next upgrade is gonna be a monster. I'm sure that he gets one. But Buccaneers team pretty good, and it's kind of like a budget team. It feels like, but it works. You know what I mean? It definitely works. So I'm gonna give this team right here let's give him like a seven not full josh allen Le'Veon bell no mike evans yeah, i'm gonna give it like a seven it, it might be like a six nine seven somewhere in that range next team up amazing tr niners 50 50 basically waiting for golden tickets yes but if you are trying to switch to a theme team right now for golden tickets the niners are a really good option they got a bunch of really cool cards coming for sure um same with like same with like the jets jets have like mike vick and um and plasco burris niners have i believe it is um i'm blanking but i know there's more than just Deion sanders it actually might just be Deion sanders i might be blanking actually i actually don't know i don't really remember but i know there's wide receiver Deion coming out soon uh for sure but here is the full niners team yeah getting get pretty nice you got randy moss i like jerry rice is definitely due for an upgrade vernon davis is the main reason why you do it for the 99 speed George Kittle on the theme team is actually kind of a monster. You don't need the two X chems, but you also, I mean, George Kittle is not a bad buy. Like, that card's kind of a monster, but you also have Pat Fryer move, so I guess it does make that a little bit harder for you. Um, Reggie Bush, W, Roger Craig, okay. Also, Roger Craig due for an upgrade too this year. Here are the specialists. Oh, we got 99 Cam Chancellor, huh? Okay, we got J Ron Curse up there. I like J Ron Curse there. Then I guess you use her with Cam Chancellor. I like that actually a lot. I really do. Um, Deion Sanders, we got Traverius Ward on, on the full theme team, Randy Moss, the re with the Redux art, looking crazy, and we got Chase Young there as well, okay, this team's like a 9, like a 9, 1, 9, 2, maybe a little bit better, not, nah, it might be better, it might be like a 9, 5, 
I'm happy. I'm happy with giving this guy like a 9.5. I'm happy with that. We'll give him a 9.5. I like that. Next up, we got Curry the Shot 30. Okay. Uh, full Vikings theme team. Let's see what we got here. Adrian Peterson. I would. Oh, I, I don't see any signs of Cordero Patterson. Cordero Patterson should be your running back unless you've already used him and you're already sick of him. But Cordero Patterson is better than Adrian Peterson, especially on a Vikings team. Colin Johnson, Ahmad Rashad. The Vikings definitely have better receivers than this. You, you could add Randy Moss to the squad. Um, you have options there. I think Randy Moss has to be on this team. I know the coins are a little bit low, but the next thing that you should probably try to do is get Randy Moss on the squad. Other than that, Randall Cunningham, 10 AP. Gunslinger, long range, hot rat on Randall. I don't hate that. That's not a bad setup right there. Not a bad setup. Defensively, we got Randy Moss. You got Patrick Peterson. I like that. Stephon Diggs. Uh, who else is that it daniel hunter 96 sheldon richardson anthony Barr, not full anthony Barr. no it is not with troy diet middle linebacker i'm sure you don't use him hmm i'm gonna give this squad right here like a like a nice eight i would i would probably say i would like to see cordero patterson randy moss yeah maybe some better edge rushers some better pass rush i think is definitely needed here i feel like you're definitely slacking at pass rusher you actually don't really realize how important good pass rush is until you like just don't have it. So I'd probably say the pass rush is the th thing that's definitely lacking on this squad for sure. Okay, but let's go down here. Here's a specialist, by the way. Yeah, you're not improving there much. But you have Derwin James as well, who's, who's actually a pretty nice user. Okay, not a theme team. Did a lot of power up since you last rated my squad in eight because I didn't power anyone up. Okay, let's see what he's got. Yeah, I think I actually remember this guy's team. Because he didn't have a theme team and he wasn't powering up cards, which is very important. Okay, JC Horn, I don't think needs to be powered up as long as we have it, you know, full strat cards. It's okay. We got Stingley, JC, Ramsey, Mike Haynes, three really good corners. Brian Dawkins, Bernard Pollard, two good safeties. We got Elroy, we got Perry, we got Chase Young, we got Quinn Williams, Miles Jack, Max Crosby. That defense is looking stacked right there. Okay, let's see this offense though. Got the brand new Charles Cross. We got Evan Neal as well. Calvin Johnson, Cooper Cup. By the way, these rookie cards, like for their price, there a lot of them are actually pretty good bang for your buck, especially like the pass rush guys. Maybe not the receivers if you don't have a theme team, but definitely like Charles Cross, Evan Neal. I would say people were asking me who's better, Sauce or Stingley. This is the way I this is what I'm gonna put it. Sauce is 6'3 with one less speed. And then Stingley is can get to 99 speed, no theme team, but he's 6'1. So I'd probably say Stingley because being 6'1 isn't bad. It's not like Stingley's 5'10. You know what I mean? So I'd probably say Stingley over Sauce as far as not being on a theme team. If you have a Jet Squad, that Sauce card's a monster for sure. But this team's really nice. I gave you an eight last time. I'm sure you've made a I mean you've made a bunch of improvements because this team's nowhere near an eight. This is like a no theme team. It actually doesn't matter because all the guys you have have 99 speed. Like all of them do. Like literally all of them. Maybe you want to throw 25, maybe 25 Falcons in there. Maybe try to get Kyle Pitts up some speed. But other than that, I mean, this is like a 9-4, 9-5. This is a really, really good team. A really, really nice team for sure. So um, I'm rocking with it, man, for sure. Definitely. Next up, we got Goat Greg 07's team. Getting Alex Mack and Moss soon. 25 Giants, Cowboys, Niners. Also, J-Ron Curse at sub. Okay. 25 Giants, Cowboys, and Niners. Okay, let's see what we got here. We got Westry, Cowboy Legend, Byron Jones, Nice Card, Richard Sherman, Deion Sanders, Taylor Mays. That's not full Lawrence Taylor. I'm not sure why. I wonder what your coin count's at because Lawrence Taylor got pretty cheap. I know that for a fact. And that card should be rostered. I mean, he's a monster. He, he's a monster. I feel like there's not that much hype about Lawrence Taylor's card, but he's actually a beast, dude. I feel like I don't see him much. I feel like I really, I actually never noticed that. When I've been playing recently, I just haven't been seeing Lawrence Taylor. Maybe I haven't been paying attention to him, but I swear I just don't see that card anywhere. But um, receiver-wise, Devontae Adams, Ed Too Tall, Golden Ticket, Future, Potential Monster, Vernon Davis, I like that. Power up Vernon Davis. Actually, don't do that. His team of the, his team of the week card is probably still very expensive. Probably still pretty pricey. But um, Reggie Bush, Randall Cunningham, Zonka. Hey, this is a good squad right here, man. This is a good little squad. Um, I'm going to give you... I'm going to give you... And you got J-Ron Curse, too. I like J-Ron Curse. Uh, this is like a high 8. I No, it's probably better than a high 8. This is tough. It might be like a 9-1. I'm going to go with the 9-1. I'm going to go with the 9-1 here, man. I rock with it, though. I definitely rock with it. Next up, we got Slayer God's team. Did he send me another picture? He didn't. 
Um, but if you want me to just look at your offense, it's a good offense. Colin Johnson on a full Giants team. Offense, offensive wise, he's actually looking pretty stacked. I would cheat on Eric Flowers though, but it looks good. It looks good to me for the offense. It looks pretty solid, but I would definitely cheat on Eric Flowers, especially because you have room. And you got Creed Humphrey. Use that rookie card art and you're set, my man. I like that. I like that a lot. Next up, we got Q's team. Q, Q, is that how you say his name? Oh my Lord. Why? Wow, this might be MMO code 30 out of 10. Hey, are you sick and tired of gambling? Are you are you sick and tired? That's the real question. This guy was sick and tired of gambling his hard-earned money on Madden packs, and he went berserk. He went absolutely berserk. Wow. Dickerson. And he's got full full Raiders as well with this squad. You're telling me you can get full Raiders and run this team? With Woodson, Randy, Mike Haynes? Wow. Wow, wow, wow. And Diablo wow this might be a 10 boys even though you have randy i think it still might be a 10 because like yeah even, even even though you have randy i mean if you have the room i mean it's still the thing about randy moss and the reason why i dislike his card a little bit is just because it's three ap for two abilities that you really don't need at cornerback and you can't run the two that you really need which is acrobat and pick artist and yes he's six four and yes he's got good stats across the board but pick artist and acrobat are needed for you know for your corners to play like they should in this game which sucks but it is what it is it really is what it is so i mean i wouldn't hate if you had maybe like a cheat there with like jc jc horn or or uh, jalen ramsey i wouldn't hate that or maybe the revis card that's gonna get revealed wait did, did they reveal revis it's seven o'clock right now. Did they reveal Revis? I, I, my guess was Revis for the limited time tonight. I got tagged in a couple things. Maybe, maybe it's Revis. Never mind. That those, those, those are just teams. Is it Revis? I'm, I know I'm wasting time right now. I'll add it to the end. Did, did they not reveal the card? Mortality? Do you have the the answer? It's Revis. 99 Revis. Limited time. Oh, he's he's a demon. One AP acrobat too. Oh man, I'm not sure what I'm about to do at cornerback. But we got to buy Rebus. Oh, no. Right, right before Golden Tickets, EA is going to do me like this. Yeah, that Rebus card looks crazy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm actually excited now for this weekend, for tomorrow, for sure. But, um, yeah, Raiders team. What, what am I going to rate this team right here? I, I'm going to go 9-9. Nine, nine. I don't think it's a 10. If you had Ramsey there, I think I gave you a 10. And you have room for cheats, right? Yeah. Wait. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I would say. That's all I'm going to say about this team. Next team up is Full Jets. Okay. I like this. Garrett Wilson, not full Elijah Moore. It's going to hurt you a little bit. Devontae Adams, Uzama. Saquon on a full Giants team is demonic as a monster truck drives by. Um, I guess LaDainian Tomlinson's dropping tomorrow, right? Which I'm recording this on Friday. LaDainian Tomlinson, try to get your hands on him. He's going to be a monster. Probably better than Saquon, especially you not having him on a theme team. Um, Kevin Mawai, offensive line serviceable for the Jets. Seems decent. I mean, I would like Fitzmagic here, honestly. Fitzpatrick. Fitzpatrick ability-wise, if you have one of his theme teams, he's just too elite elite. He's just too elite ability-wise not to run him. Like, he, like he's just so good. We got Sauce, though. Ty Law. Gotta be getting that Revis tomorrow without question. Without question, you gotta, go, you gotta try to get your hands on Revis tomorrow. Actually, that's not gonna be possible. That card's gonna be probably 800k. Yeah, he's gonna be really expensive, huh? That Revis card's gonna be demonic. Tomorrow's really just Jets Ultimate Legends, huh? You got LT and Revis, and they're both demonic. All right, I'm gonna give this squad right here in its current state, what I'm looking at right now, like a seven, dude. Like, it, it's, I mean, maybe lower. It might be like a six, five. It might be. Because you got Garrett Wilson, you got Sauce. I like that for a Jets team, but I don't like Winfield as a cheat. Like, I know he's your end cat. I don't like his card. He's, he's too small. Yeah, I don't like him as a cheat. Maybe on a Buccaneers team, but... There's no reason to run him. There's just, I mean, just sell him for training, honestly. Like, you, you can definitely find someone better out there. Um, I'm going to a 6.5 for this squad, the way it looks right now. If you get Revis and, you know, make some upgrades, but your coin count's a little low, so it might, be, might not be possible. But it is what it is. Um, next up, we got Icy Up Sun. Um, okay, a little, little uh, diverse angle here. Icy Up Sun. Packers team? Bears team? Is it a Bears? Oh, it's definitely a Saints team. You got Olave. I like that Olave card. I like Olave. I do. Mmm. Okay. Michael Thomas, Sanders, Joe Horn, Reggie Bush, Alvin, who won't get another upgrade this year. Is it Bears? Is there any Bears? No, I think it's just full Saints with Justin Fields. Yeah, the Saints' best quarterback isn't really good, right? They don't got a good quarterback, huh? 
I don't think did Fitzpatrick play for the Saints? I don't think he did. I'm not sure why I see like I don't know. I don't know why I feel like he did, but he definitely did it. He definitely did it. But Marshawn Lattimore on the edge there. You got CJ GJ playing cornerback. Interesting. PJ Williams, John Lynch, Taylor Mays, and the coin count pretty low. I really can't give you any suggestions because you got a Saints team. I would probably say the next thing you should probably try to do is get those cornerbacks up because you're using CJ GJ. Try to get one of those cornerbacks that don't need cheats, whether it's um it could be Stingley. Stingley wouldn't be bad for you. He wouldn't be bad for you. He wouldn't be bad whatsoever. Um, you know, uh, Jalen Ramsey, JC Horn, Mike Haynes, all those guys are good options. They really are. But uh, I'm going to give this squad right here. Okay, G Graham and CJ. Okay, we already saw this. Graham. Oh, he's got Graham. Okay, he's got Jimmy Graham. Okay, okay. Oh, so I see what he's doing here. He's got, okay. Let's try to keep, I guess, chems or whatever. I guess that's why he's, why he's doing that. But I'm going to give this squad right here, like, um... It's like an 8-5. It's solid. I think it's solid for sure. I think it's probably better than what I thought. Um, next up, we got um, my man uh, Proud's team. Uh, shout out to my man Proud. Okay. What team is this, though? Uh, full Seattle. Start grinding my coin stack now. Hey, you got a pretty good coin stack. And you got Kearney. Yo, so... I mean, Kearney's a demon, though. Kearney's a demon, but his card is like... It's tough to justify owning that card. You know what I mean? Like It's tough to justify owning Patrick Kearney. It is because I know that price tag is a little bit crazy. That's gonna that's literally gonna be me holding on the Rebus for the rest of the year. That's gonna be tough for me. But hey, we gotta yeah, you gotta do what you gotta do. You got you gotta do what you gotta do sometimes. But um, mean Joe Green, Kevin Williams, Jack Youngblood, Richard Sherman, Deion Sanders, Full Nick Bolton, uh, Levon Kirkland, Luke Keekley, Brian Dawkins. It's a good team. Edrin, yup. Full Russell Wilson. You can't be running Russell with the with the Broncos. Art, right, you're a demon for real. Um, Jay Curhan, 99, Colbert, Tree Humphrey needs to be in that core rookie R. We got Charles Cross. Okay, I mean, this is a good team, bro. This is a damn good team. Next Jerry upgrade, you're probably gonna push down someone, probably Joey Galloway. I would probably push down Joey Galloway on the next Jerry Rice upgrade, but that's me. I'm gonna give this squad right here like a nine, like a nine three. This team's good. Good corners. Sherman on the full theme team, a dog. Um, I think DK is getting that cornerback card, right? Oh, no, no, it's Mike Evans. I no, 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 DK is getting that cornerback card. I'm still pretty sure on that. All right, let's do the final team. String Cheese. I feel like I do his team every single week, but um, he sends it in, man. So, you know, I, he does get rated. Full Cowboys? Cowboys team? He didn't tell me. Cowboys team with some absolute dogs for sure, man. You got Evan Ingram, Goal 99, Leo Collins, Austin Colbert, Tyler Biotz, Biotz, Larry Allen. Michael Irvin. Oh, oh my. Yeah, they're they're nice, bro. I mean, they're, they're pretty good. You know, he's solid. Westry Silver Art. Oh, he's a demon. This team might be a 10, bro. I'm not even lying. This team might be a 10. This team might be a 10 to end the day. Zeke, what does Zeke have? Zeke has 95, 94 speed? 94, 95 speed. I think Zeke's got 94 speed. So, no. No, Zeke, yeah, Zeke has 94 speed, so powered up 95, and then on the Dallas team with plus two, 97 speed Zeke isn't bad. It's not bad. It's not bad. I, I don't, I'm not going to knock him because the Zeke card isn't good. I'm not going to knock him for that. Like, I'm not going to knock him because he, he doesn't have 99 speed. I think we're going to end this day with a 10. All for the offline teams, this is a 10, man. This is a 10. Really, really nice squad, man. Really, really nice squad. I'm going to have higher overalls if... You know, it's weird how you put ends at tackle and their overalls go down, even though Aaron Donald and, and Adama Kinsu literally play defensive tackle for the majority of their snaps. Yeah, it's weird, but that's how EA works. I'm going to give this team a 10, man. I like this team a lot, String Cheese. Getting better every week. Hey, this could be you. Hey, this could be you. I've rated String Cheese's team a lot. And look, he's got, he's got a 10 out of 10 squad because he listens to the greatest advice on YouTube. You know what I mean? So <laughs> shout out to String Cheese. I'm completely, I'm completely kidding, by the way. But um, yeah, let's hop into... Um, our offline teams. Let's go ahead and do it. Let's do it. Um, we got Speed's team. We got Speed's team. First thing I'm going to say, let's work on the wire management a little bit. I think you could definitely maybe tie those cords together. Um, I think that's a good start. You know, you know, just get, maybe get a little Velcro, maybe get a little tape, maybe get something going there. Let's tighten up that wire management a little bit. You know what I mean? Let's tighten that up a little bit. And um, outside of that, what we got here? Oh, Jets team. 30 Jets, 30 Raiders. Gannon, is that... This is Budget Gannon. Is Budget Gannon still a demon? I bet. Is Budget, Gan is Budget Gannon a demon? I actually didn't try this card out. Usually I try him out. Okay, but we got Randy Moss. 
Cliff Branch. I think you got a. Oh, you got Randy though. Look, we get Garrett Wilson. Garrett Wilson will be good for this team. He's not that expensive. What's the coin at? Oh, okay, that's tough. But try to get Garrett Wilson. I'd say. If you can get Garrett Wilson, six foot route runner, replace him with Branch. I'd like Deshaun Jackson in that third slot. Marshawn on the Raiders team with the X Factors, I think is a W. Eventually, Powell will get to 99 for you, which will be nice. Offensive line is it's decent. We got Sauce. Trayvon Diggs, no theme team, right? Trayvon Diggs, no theme team. Trayvon Diggs, no theme team and not powered up. He's got to go. Yo, he's got to go. He's got to go. Trayvon Diggs. Trayvon, I, I, he's your end cat, though, so it's tough, but he can't be on the field. He, he literally can't be on the field, bro. Literally can't be on the field. Got Jermaine Johnson, shoot Charles Woodson. Definitely a Jets fan. Yeah, so I'd try, yeah, I'd say get Garrett Wilson, bro. He he's, would be a big upgrade for you. I would try to get a cornerback, a, a cornerback three. I, I doubt that the the dumbed down version of a, what's his name, is going to be worth it tomorrow. Yeah, turn that down, bro. But, uh, yeah, you got to get rid of the end cat, Trayvon Diggs, bro. You got to, you got to. He's got to go. One AP route? He's who, who has one AP route? Oh, hot route. Oh, 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 I see what you're saying. I see what you're saying. Go 25. You guys think it's worth him switching his theme team for Trayvon Diggs, who's already, like, not that great on the Dallas team? You really, you really feel like that's worth it? I, I don't think so. I have Moss, Ramsey, Haynes, and Westry. Um, probably, probably Moss, bro. Yeah, I don't think I feel like that's not worth it. But um, this is actually like not a bad budget team. I, I like how you have a lot of the guys. If I were you, I'd try to get Fitz Magic. I, I think Fitz Magic would fit here a lot, uh, fit a lot better here for you. Um, you'll have like the same AP, same AP. You know what I mean? Plays on the Jets team. Probably has some better stats than Gannon. Definitely a better release than Gannon. So I, I wouldn't hate Fitz Magic there. And, and I would just upgrade that corner. And also, yeah, Jamal Adams is not good enough anymore. And he's not powered up. Jamal's got to be upgraded. Ronnie Lott needs to be upgraded. This team is probably like, I, like there's got to be some good budget safeties out there. Um, I'm going to give this team like a, it's like a five, bro. It's like a five. It's like a five. The sa safeties aren't good. Bad cornerback three. But it, it's, it's a good, it's a good start, I think. It's a good start. Like, I like Gardner. Charles Woodson, I like it. I like it. Um, but yeah, I think it's like a five, bro. I think it's like a solid five. 97 end cap free safety. Yeah, yeah, I like some of the guys he has. He's got to fill in some of the holes better. Pause, but you know what I mean? But outside of that, I'm rocking with it, bro. I'm rocking with it. Yeah, this is like a this is like a little this would have been a god squad in December. You know what I mean? Would have been a god squad. I'm blocking some players. It is what it is. He's, he's a 99 overall. You're a 99 overall team? Oh, you actually are. Okay, Reggie Bush is the... Okay. Cooper Cub, Devontae Adams, Randy Moss. Is there any team here? Is there any team or no? Is there a team here? Niners, Rams, and Vikings. That's a pretty good squad right there. Niners, Rams, Vikings. Niners, Rams, Vikings. I feel like I, I, know, I feel like I would like Dickerson. I feel like I would like Dickerson more than Reggie Bush on a 25. Or is that just me? Like I feel like I would like Dickerson more. Right? Or or no? No? Let me see Glay Ray Homer. Okay. You're a passer. Okay, if you're a passer, then I guess that that's another thing. I guess so. We got uh, Chris Long, Jalen Ramsey, good corners across the board. With uh, Ronnie Lott, Elroy. I mean, this is just a good team, bro. I don't know. What, this might this might end up being a 10. This probably end up being a 10. Vernon Davis. This is a good this is a good team, bro. Offensive line's nasty. Could a 10 team have Randall, though? Could a 10 team have Randall? Could a 10 team have Randall? Yeah, they do. They, they they do, Matthew. Don't like Slinger 1. That's fair. 
All right, we'll give you a 10, bro. We'll give you a 10. I, I, this team looks pretty good. I, I feel like for preference and stuff like that, this team is... There's really nothing you're doing wrong here. You know what I mean? You got you got 25. You still got a theme team going too, which I like. I'm with it. I'm with it. I'm with it for sure. I, this is a 10 right 10. This is a good team. 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 Larry Wilson doesn't see the field, but he's a locker room legend. Okay, 6-1. I, oh, I am recording this. 6-1 DBs are cursed in my cornerbacks and my cornerback. Okay, okay, I, I see. 6-1. I understand the way that works. Barn Micah dropping the zones with Lurker. Two inside stuffs, Peters and Sue. Okay. Open these up. Great screenshots, by the way, Jack. Great, great execution. Great execution here. Great execution. All right. Here we go. Let's see what Jock's let's see what Jock's working with here. 25 Cardinals, 25 Cowboys, 25 Niners, 25 Rams. Okay, we know Jock runs the 18 AP setup. Dickerson, I like that. You guys know how I feel about Dickerson. Offensive line solid. 99 speed Vernon Davis with George Kittle. I have the same tight ends, which is intimate. They're good. Cooper Cup, still a dog. CeeDee Lamb, good on a Cowboys team with Randy Moss. That's the defense. Jalen Ramsey, Westry on the on the Dallas team with Night Train Lane as well. Ed Tall. Chris Long, Keith. I mean, yeah, this team. Yeah, he says he drops Micah and Barr into coverage. Larry doesn't see the field. I, I think we should make a. I think, that, I think there should be a. Um, there should definitely be a case for Larry Wilson cracking the starting lineup. I think if you need a big play late in the game, you got to sub in Larry Wilson. You know what I mean? I think you got to sub. Like his veteran presence and leadership, I think, has to be on the field. But that's just me personally. 8-6 to 8-9? What are you? Are you uh are you good? For 6-1, this is nasty. Because Cam Chancellor is nasty in 6-1. And Curse is also disgusting in 6-1. Ravage out of 10. What's his O? Um, yeah, I don't know. I think Jock runs, I think he runs Panthers, I want to say. I think he runs Carolina, low-key. Jock, you run Carolina. I feel like I remember, I remember you saying that saying that the other night. Well, this seems good, bro. I, I mean, 25-25-25. Car, I'm a bunch of upset right now. Let's see. This team's a high. This team's not a ten. I'm gonna give you a nine, nine seven on this team. I'm gonna give you a nine seven. Trash AP setup. I'm not gonna tell another man what AP to run. Like this is if you if you play well with 18 AP in your quarterback, you go for it. It's not you. You can call it a trash AP setup if he has Homer with no X factor. What can you improve? I mean, you gotta wait, low key. I think you just gotta wait for. I mean. I would like to see Creed Humphrey rookie card art at center, but that's just me. But um, the next, the golden ticket Dion that's coming out, you got to get your hands on him, 100%. Um, who else would be coming out golden ticket wise for you? Um, is Dallas got any good? Bobby Trees? Maybe linebackers or edges? Oh, yeah, we can definitely look at that. Linebackers or edges? You're running, you're running Corey Peters? Corey Peter, Corey Peter sees the field. I guess he has to see the field for you, though, right? To run 25, 25, 25, he literally has to see the field for you. What is Rashad Lawrence? What what team's Rashad Lawrence? Oh, yeah, golden ticket. Ed Too Tall is going to be a dog for you, too. Oh, Z's getting a golden ticket? 2X cards for Rashad? Oh, damn. Okay, I mean, who could you... I'm just trying to think. You know what I wouldn't hate actually? Can you can does Sue get secondary defensive tackle cams? I feel like if Sue gets backup, I feel like if Sue gets secondary defensive tackle cams, you put him in there instead of Brockers and you and you use him over Corey Peters. I feel like that's what you should do. I think you should use Aaron Donald in there instead of Corey Peters. And then still run a novel can Sue because he's a 93, but he's a goal 99. You know what I mean? But I think I think. I think Donald would be an upgrade over Corey Peters for sure. Like Donald, Donald has good traits, can do everything. This card's got like 90-something speed. Like, he's, he's a demon. Yeah, I know Sue's a monster. Sue, Sue's, a, Sue's a monster. Yeah, I saw Mets in the hitter. I, me and Max were watching it. Run Dak? No, I, I don't like Dak, dude. I don't like Dak. I, I think if you're, no, you're going to run this setup where you're going to run a skate artist, literally his only option would be Trey Lance. He tried Donald. Donald plays just amazing. And he can play on the inside too. He can definitely play on the inside. 
Same for Kyler. Yeah, Kyler would be the ideal guy for you being a scrambler. But I, I'm telling you, we're, we're, we're about to get a Joe Montana card who's about to be disgusting. Actually, I don't know. How could they? They, they couldn't make Joe Montana. They couldn't make Joe Montana a top five quarterback in the game, Loki. I don't think that they could. They couldn't make Joe Montana a top five quarterback in the game if he came out today. He would be better than Rich Gannon, but there's just like, I don't, he's got traditional one. They couldn't make Joe Montana better unless they surprise drop a Steve Young on our heads, but he's still a lefty. What's wrong with Joe? I mean, dude, to be top five right now is tough, you know? We're at the end of the year. It's not like it's not like Joe Montana's gonna come out and he's gonna push he's gonna push ahead the quarterback. You know what I mean? Joe's kind of tough. He led me to my top 100 before. Oh, he did. So you're rocking with Joe. But I feel like right now there's just better options. I feel like right now there's just better options. Like traditional one release. Yeah, I'm gonna go like nine. Yeah, I'm with Trev there. I think it's like a nine, nine, eight, nine, seven. I'm I'm with that. Actually, nine, nine. I don't go nine, nine, but we'll go nine, nine, eight, nine, seven. Joe Joe Namath's the better Joe. Yeah, I think, yeah, I, dude, that would be tough, though, but I feel like Joe Montana would have, like, 97 speed. Like, they're going to do him nasty. Well, the next Dan Marino card's about to be hell, too. Dude, Dan Marino's actually, if, if Dan Marino is like, affordable, bro, it's GG's. Everyone's going to have Dan Marino. It's going to suck, actually. That's actually going to kill the game. That's going to kill the game, actually. That's going to kill the game. Dan Marino coming out will kill the game. If Randall Cunningham didn't kill it enough, Dan Marino's going to kill the game. 100%. 100%, dude. I hated... Vernon card? Ver Vernon's the best tight end in the game. Vernon might be the best offensive player in the game. He might be. I especially on a Niners team. You have a 99 speed tight end with one AP route tech. He might be the best in the game. Just offensively in general. He might be. There's a good case for him being number one. There's no one else like him. CD's my best. CD's my best wide receiver, which is shot. Is he really? He's got the good animations. I like Randy a lot. I cut Randy though. But that was just because I... I'd rather use Garrett Wilson. You know? Yeah, the next Keyshawn card's gonna be fired too. Keyshawn's next card, and he's any he, and he does get Cowboys cams. Well, if Marino's not a if Marino's a limited time card, then yeah, he wouldn't drop under two mil. But if he's just a normal UL, then he will. Then he will. He's gonna be like 600 k Okay. Swuno's team, here we go, man. Here we go for Swuno's team. Doesn't use his linebackers, which is clearly, it's very clear to him. None of the linebackers he uses, not a single one of them. 25 Panthers, 25 Rams. 25 Panthers, and 25 Rams. JC Horn, I like that. Aaron Donald, I like that. Almost the full Davenport. Yo, when's the new season coming out? There's gotta be one more season, right? It's gotta be one more season. This team, this this defense is not that great. Cause I know you have to have a 50-50 theme team to get Marcus made at 99 speed. So I know it's it can't be that great. Jeremy Chin, I think, has 95, 94 speed. What is what is Jeremy? I think Jeremy Chin is either 94, 95 speed, so he can't get it either. He cannot get it either. But JC Horn, fire. Night train, fire. Jalen Ramsey, fire. Let's see the offense. Randy, Keish. I like the Keyshawn's. It's still a good card, especially on a, on a theme team. I run four corners. I need four. Wait, who's your fourth corner? I didn't look at him. Oh, Westry. I like that. So who doesn't see the field? Oh, doesn't have two receiver strat cards? I don't think he needs them. Oh, he might for Keyshawn, but I know he does need it for Calvin, right? Yeah, I saw Dr. Disrespect did a Niners pick. All right, we got Aaron Rodgers. Why is Aaron Rodgers got the 2012 drip going? Why does he look like that? Dickerson, this is the best Dickerson art for sure. I rock with this Dickerson art. Offensive line. Oh, is that an 85 on the O-line at tackle? Is he out of position? Please tell me these guys are out of position. I don't think, you know, Richie, that's Richie's position. What are we doing? No way. Michael A. Taylor, bro. I can buy a new one. I have 130. You spin a wheel, bro. Honestly, I don't know what this is. Or pick, um... Oh, you can't go back and pick Baselli now. Hey, Baselli was the move, boys. I, I told you. If you were going to play the game the rest of the year, Baselli was the move. Actually, I kind of regret not trying Taylor Mays. He was fun. He looked, he looked fun. He looked fun. How do you get Brown to a 99? Who's Brown? 
Antonio? I mean Antonio Brown? Dude, the, the, this dude, don't run it left, bro. Dude, do not run the ball left. Please do not run the ball left, bro. Please don't do it. Do not run that football left, man. It ain't gonna work. Maze is a dog. Tell him, yeah, he, he's good, yeah. I just journal my mind away. It would be a lot easier to drill to your mind away if you had some left tackles and right tackles, bro. I've actually never... I'm actually so disgusted by him having a fucking September offensive line. I'm giving him a fucking six, dude. I'm actually so disgusted by... He literally has a September offensive line. It's September. If you get that old line in September, I'm still like, oh, there might be a better left tackle out there. That's how wild it is for him to have Cam Irvin on the field. Ha, Cam Irvin. With a long neck. <laughs> I, I think. Swino, thank you for the gifted to Taz. Appreciate you, bro. But I'm still, I'm not improving your rating because you have a September offensive line. Actually brutal. I'm giving you a, I'll give you a 6-6, six, six, bro. Brooks is a 99 on my Titans team. He's one less speed than AJ, but three inches taller. What's Brooks? 6-4? Bro, Hell Mary pack and get him. A, yeah, if you rip a if you do a get a gold player, there's a chance you get a better uh, right tackle. Another one, swim with another gifted. All right, we'll, we'll bump it to seven. He's trying to give for a better. He's trying to give. Hopefully, you guys see this. You know, you know what I mean. I'm with it, bro. I'm with it. Appreciate it, Swino. Appreciate you, man. Corrupt. It might be corrupt. Jock, if you give a couple, Jock, maybe I'll, maybe we'll um talk about a ten rating for your squad, man. Maybe. Maybe we talk about it. Cheer your bags for some. He's on a 39 game winning streak.